Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. My name is Hafiza Noreen and my roll number is PP1650074. The main topic of the assignment is rational and irrational use of drugs. And the drug given is carbamazepine. So what are the indications of carbamazepine? Carbamazepine is used to prevent and control seizures. This medication is known as an anticonvulsant or anti-epileptic drug. It is also used to relieve certain types of nerve pain. What are the toxicity and adverse effects? It causes dizziness, imbalance, drowsiness, coma, and generalized seizures. It can cause abnormal cardiac conduction that can lead to arrhythmia. It has been reported that acute carbamazepine toxicity could be associated with the presence of a spindle coma on EEG. Anticholinergic symptoms are common with carbamazepine toxicity, hypochromic anemia, and minor rhabdomyolysis as well as resultant movement disorder also have been reported. What are the contraindications with carbamazepine? A disorder with excess antidiuretic hormone called syndrome of inappropriate antidiuretic hormone, high cholesterol, suicidal thoughts, depression, myasthenia gravis, which is a skeletal muscle disorder, glaucoma, which is an increased pressure in the eye. What are the drug interactions? So carbamazepine with eripiprazole, using these medications together may cause eripiprazole to be less effective. Acetaminophen with carbamazepine. Using acetaminophen together with carbamazepine may alter the effects of acetaminophen and cause serious side effects that may affect your liver. Dosage forms. Carbamazepine could be present as an immediate release tablet, 200 mg given as an oral. Extended release tablet, 100 to 400 mg given as an oral. Extended release capsule, 100 to 300 mg given as an oral. Oral suspension, 100 mg per 5 ml given as an oral. IV solution, 10 mg per ml given through intravenous route. What are the brand names? So, Apitol, which is as a chewable tablets, Teril, which is an oral suspension, Carnixip, which is an IV solution. Dosage adjustment, first for immediate release. Increase weekly in increments up to 200 mg per day as equally divided doses three or four times a day until an optimal response is obtained. Maintenance of dose between 800 to 1200 milligram per day. Maximum dose is 1600 milligram per day. For extended release, increase weekly in increments of 200 milligram per day as equally divided doses twice a day until an optimal response is obtained. Maximum dose should be 1600 milligram per day. What are the rational use of carbamazepine? So it is used to prevent control, used to prevent and control seizures. This medication is known as an anticonvulsant or anti-epileptic drug. It is also used to relieve certain types of nerve pain. What are the irrational use? So carbamazepine is a prescription medicine used to treat the symptoms of epilepsy, trigeminal neuralgia, and bipolar mania. What are the drug alternatives? So the alternative drug used against carbamazepine is Lamictal and Topamax. My case study is a 26 years old woman was referred to our emergency department 
with a complaint of bilateral groin pain and a 12 year history of irregular carbamazepine use subject age of uh, woman age is 26 years old chief complaint bilateral groin pain medical history is 12 year history of irregular carbamazepine use object bilateral femoral neck insufficiency fracture due to irregular long term carbamazepine use bilateral dynamic hip screw osteosynthesis was performed assessment there are several risk factor for insufficiency fracture and anti epileptic drug related osteoporosis is one of the reason these drugs have negative effect on bone metabolism and bone mineral density plan joint and bone pain with a history of long term use of anti epileptic drug should be investigated carefully and insufficiency fracture should be kept in mind that's it jazakallah